the accounting records of the Defense Department are such that a good set of books has not yet been delivered to the Controller General of the General Accounting Office so that an audit of the entire federal government can be had. And this is because the Defense Department is so huge and its material weaknesses are so great that there is an inability to opine on the entire federal government's financial condition. Truth in government has been pressing for federal transparency and accountability since I left Washington over 25 years ago and founded it. In fact, in November 2014, I attended the National Defense Forum held at the Reagan Presidential Library in Simi Valley, California, and confronted a panel of senior defense officials as to why it is taking so long for the Defense Department to present an appropriate set of books to the Government Accountability Office so that the audit of the entire federal government could be done. And this has been a requirement since 1994. You've got two major problems. Let me talk about briefly the numbers. The budget problem and a public relations problem. Mm. What's the budget problem? The budget this year, round numbers, $3.8 trillion. 65% of it, including the interest we pay out, is mandatory, including, obviously, a program like Medicaid. So 35% is discretionary. Right. Half that budget is the defense. So you got a problem to compete against the others in that 35%. Education, you name it, all kinds of important things. To do that, you got to make a good case. How do you make a good case? I'll get to the public relations problem, accountability. When the DOD, the requirement for financial statements, the act that I introduced, started in 1994, the Controller General, in his report, the last statement put out, says that the armed services, the DOD, will not be able to comply and get an opinion because there are such material weaknesses in the way you account for things and you want more money. So is there a question in there? The question is, why is it taking so long? I mean, it's not rocket science accounting. You got to get the right people Anyone in there to, to try to figure out why you can't get an okay. audit of the DOD. Secretary James and Dr. Zakhan. Um, I'm going to, rather than try to explain why, I'm going to agree with you. It has taken too long. And I mentioned briefly that this is something we're hard, uh, working hard on in the Air Force. It, we're working hard across the Department of Defense, including Frank, Bob Work above him. I think stay tuned very shortly, like within the next year, you're going to see that we're going to have major advances. We're going to get there. My 03 budget calls for more than $48 billion in new defense spending. More money for the Pentagon when its own auditors admit the military cannot account for 25% of what it already spends. According to some estimates, we cannot track $2.3 trillion in transactions. $2.3 trillion with a T. That's $8,000 for every man, woman, and child in America. I wanted you to know that Truth in Government remains dedicated to its mission of fiscal responsibility and financial accountability at all levels of our federal government. So please continue to support our mission of good government by going to truthingovernment.org today.